9.20 a.m. There you go. There you go. Right underneath my window. Uh, order of protection. And he's going to cross the street right now. Uh, the car is parked across the street. Order of protection continues. This is the reason why uh, the mules are taking so long to come out of 5130. Our order of protection is being used to manipulate my ex-wife. I am harassing the next door neighbors. Um, it was pre-planned, pre-parked, right across the street. And he's inside the vehicle right now, uh, waiting. For instructions. Ah, here's the little baby uh, ride along. The little baby ride along. Right here. And this is, a, a, a course. This is the reason for the order of protection. And he's going back. And he got the book back. That's a good indication that this is a white powder bag pickup. And he's going to go to the back. Uh, this is the reason for the order of protection, folks. There you go. He's in the back. And the candy man is back there as well. This address is 5132 West 24th Street in Laramie, Cicero, Illinois, 60804. Uh, he is still waiting inside the vehicle. Order of protection continues. And um, it's um, 9.23 p.m. I mean a.m. 9.23 a.m. August 4th, 2024. Oh, here we go. There you go. Uh, the mule just uh, stepped in. Okay, so there's a lot of movement going on. So the little uh, baby ride along continues at five one three two. Five one three two. And they're back there uh, working with the candy man next door, 5130. And we are still waiting for the mules to uh, come out. Um, the blue car in front is hiding and the white van is hiding. And the candy man is hiding as well. <clears throat> and you just witnessed uh, homeowner Martinez's son on command signal. Walking underneath my uh, window, bait, focus, follow, attention. Uh, that's a distraction, but it's also an order of protection. Manipulate my ex-wife, I am harassing the next door neighbors. And this is the reason for the order of protection right here. Uh, this is uh, a white powder bag 
pickup cocaine. This is a cocaine pickup, and the book bag is being used uh, to transport the white powder substance known as cocaine. So uh, they're back there right now with uh, the candy man and uh, the person in charge of this property at uh, 5132. They live in the basement. And it's a young couple with an infant baby and uh, a very young government pincher dog. 5132. They're back there. They're back there and they're loading up. And of course, this is the reason for the murder plot continues. Extreme high level frequency harassment uh, coming from next door, 5135 West 24th Street in Laramie, Cicero, Illinois 60804. Organized crime family. Oh, I see movement back there again. There's a lot of movement back there, back and forth. They're coming in and coming out. A lot of movement. And it looks like this is going to be a quick uh, pickup. And, um, yeah, daily ordered instructions by Anthony J. Loder, Avila Greco, Nello Greco. And, um, well, yes, just uh, the day before yesterday, you witnessed uh, my ex-wife uh, being attacked. Extreme high-level frequency harassment is used to manipulate the victim and to heighten the victim's emotional disturbance state of mind. Uh, she reacted by breaking my phone. And uh, she has no control over that. It, uh, she, she's in fear. She's afraid. She's concerned. And um, she took it out on the phone. So uh, it's, it's recorded. And this is a high-tech surveillance monitor, again, that can uh, transport, transmit and transfer electrical shock to the brain and frequencies to heighten the victim's emotional disturbance state of mind. And she reacted, and that's the game plan to manipulate the victims at home. Unsolved murder cases of identity theft Medicaid, victims are preconditioned at home to react. We are waiting. It's um, 9.28 a.m. 9.28 a.m. And of course, this high-tech surveillance monitor is how they're carrying out this murder plot against my life. I just uh, visited uh, for the second time... Uh, Illinois State Police in Aurora. Um, I want to thank them for taking the time to uh, talk to me. And I, I, uh, I gave them my information again. And I, I advised them to keep an eye on me. My life is in danger. And uh, they appreciate the work I do. And we're going to continue. We're going to continue focusing on their main revenue source. Again... Uh, the IRS is investigating uh, 5132 right here. 5132, uh, the little baby right along continues. And they quickly moved uh, new tenants in the second floor. Uh, the first floor remains vacant. And the basement is occupied by the, um, the young couple that are in, uh, in charge of this property. But uh, they moved in uh, uh, new tenants in the second floor to avoid investigation by the IRS, Internal Revenue Services. And this address is 5132. Uh, we are waiting for the mules. Again, the mules have been instructed to hide their vehicles. Uh, right here and right here. The white van, which are new mules that just moved in, a male and female, just moved in. Community gang stalking in the background. Here you go. That's community gang stalking. 
Um, organized crime family is responding. Time, 9.30 a.m. 9.30 a.m. August the 4th, 2024, Sunday morning. Uh, organized crime family is uh, working constantly to distribute the white powder bag known as cocaine. Uh, Thomas Cicero Police Department protection cover up dirty little secret white powder bags. Uh, we have before and after evidence of fire right here. 5130. No investigation, cover up. And the permit right there. The main clientele, construction workers on the job and the guy that put that uh, permit sign there, he has a red van that he usually hides behind the tree. And he's the person in charge of this uh, work that, that's being done. And he's their main clientele. Well documented on video. He's a steady customer. Okay, uh, we're going to move on. And we are still waiting for uh, again the order of protection continues. Uh, homeowner Martinez's son was instructed uh, to try and bait me. Uh, again, bait, focus, follow, attention, and he is uh, parked across the street, and he even gave me the eye contact on video. And, of course, that's a distraction to avoid uh, recording the little baby right along. Same time frame. And to avoid recording uh, the mule that came back from a special delivery way part of bags. He was, he was the one that was parked in the driveway. He just parked someplace else and ran back inside. And he's going to be... Uh, they're only allowed to carry a certain amount. Um... That's why they got to continue coming back and forth uh, to avoid um, investigation. Okay, time, 9.33 a.m. We are still waiting and we're going to move on. Again, this is part one, little baby right along.